How to identify and address a sexless marriage A sex therapist shares how to amp up the intimacy in your relationship. In this article Signs of a Sexless Marriage How common are they? What causes a sexless marriage? How to address a sexless marriage? Technically, experts define a sexless marriage as one in which a couple is having sex less than 10 times a year. But it's not as simple as that. What is a sexless marriage? A sexless marriage refers to a married couple who has little to no sexual activity with each other. What sex means to one couple may look very different to another couple, says Stephanie Roca, a New York-based psychotherapist and sex therapist. There is no ideal or correct frequency that works for all couples. While one couple, for example, may see it as a problem if they aren't having sex every week, Another might think that's a lot. Ahead, Roka explains how to identify a sexless marriage, address a sexless marriage, and more. Signs of a sexless marriage Roka encourages couples to create their own idea of how much sex they want to have in a marriage. That doesn't just mean intercourse, but also other forms of physical and emotional connection. That way, they can set their own expectations and understand if they are falling short of them. Ultimately, it's the couple who determines if they're experiencing lack of sex and sexual intimacy, she says. Don't be discouraged if you do decide you are in a sexless marriage. If you're in a supportive, committed relationship, improving sexual intimacy is absolutely possible. How common are sexless marriages? If you are in a sexless marriage, you are hardly alone. Roca insists. She adds, it is very common for couples to experience lack of sex and lowered desire and interest in sex at some point in their relationship. Some researchers put the number as high as 20%, depending on how long a couple has been together. It's also important to note that if your sex life, or lack thereof, is distressing you, that is completely normal. Sex therapist Barry McCarthy found that when a couple's sex life is good, it only amounts to 10 to 15 percent of their relationship satisfaction, but when sex is a challenge or there is a lack of sex, it accounts for 40 to 50 percent of a couple's satisfaction. It goes without saying that couples who report sexual problems in their relationship are significantly distressed and, as a result, this will affect their overall relationship satisfaction offers Roca. She encourages individuals to remember that there is nothing wrong with them. Couples need to understand that this commonly happens, and it's not a reflection of the lack of love or commitment they have for one another, she says. Working towards sexual satisfaction and health in a relationship is constant and a complex process, though not impossible, and one that deserves special attention and patience. What causes a sexless marriage? Per Roca, there are several reasons for lack of sex in a relationship, and those reasons can vary from couple to couple. A growing family When parents welcome a new child into a relationship, it can be hard to care for a new baby while also making time for themselves and each other. Both men and women have postpartum experiences and feelings that can contribute to this. Anxiety and depression Stress is a very common cause of sex problems. When stress is high within a couple, they are less likely to create sexual scenarios due to preoccupation with the stressors. She explains, couples are more inclined to practice and take opportunities to connect intimately if they've learned coping skills to manage stress. Any mental health issue, like depression and anxiety, can lead to a sexless marriage. Roca puts it simply, you can't have anxiety and arousal at the same time. A vicious cycle. No sex or unsatisfying sex can lead to the problem continuing. Couples who describe themselves as having a sexless marriage can feel very hopeless and pessimistic about their sexual relationship and future, she says. Many couples who are experiencing a lack of sex often anticipate future sexual encounters negatively which also continues the negative cycle and lowers the likelihood they will make attempts for intimacy. How to have a healthy sex life in your marriage How to address a sexless marriage Of course, once you find yourself in a sexless marriage, there are ways to address the predicament and become more intimate with your partner. Change your expectations The media tells us that every sexual encounter should be sexy, hot, stimulating, 
and satisfying. But the reality is much different, says Roca. I'd challenge the myth and steer away from the idea that every sexual counter must be great for it to be good, she says. The fact is, not every sexual encounter will be as amazing as you would want, and this does not mean it wasn't good enough. Enjoy the moment and connection rather than focus on how many times you have sex or how long it lasts. Roca offers, couples who are attuned and connected are more likely to enjoy and find pleasure in sex, as there is more trust and vulnerability present during their sex lives. Take a break from sex. Some couples might benefit from taking the pressure of having sex off the table. Obligatory or pressured sex can make things worse for both couples leading to feelings of frustration or isolation. Instead, find other ways to connect. Roca says, creating opportunities to connect in non-sexual ways can include holding hands, hugging, and daily appreciations of each other. Seek professional help. If a couple determines that their loss of sexual intimacy and absent or low desire is negatively impacting their relationship, it's important to seek consultation from a sex therapist. She advises, couples therapy creates safety and opportunities to share their feelings and wishes with each other while being guided by a professional. It also can be useful to speak to a therapist to address any other issues that can be contributing to their sexual relationship. And don't put it off. Waiting for it to get better on its own can lead to more difficulties, she reveals.